this is harder part of our project here we have used many types of sensor and module which are temperature sensor PIR sensor IR sensor current sensor voltage sensor RTC module relay GPS and GSM module RFID module etc we have used two type of display for show the output this is OLED display and this is LCD display this LCD display we used car parking system and this display we used main door and this display we show all output and this is product counting system display this is temperature and humidity sensor this is flame sensor and this is gas sensor this is 20 into 4 LCD display this display we show temperature Fahrenheit and Celsius and humidity percentage gas level AC voltage and current this is GPS module this is GSM module this is AC voltage sensor this is relay this is uh, dimmer circuit we use uh, voltage regulate for this sector our industry main power this transformer this is 1.5 ampere this is main power source of our whole system this is current sensor this is product counting system and this is IoT part and this room our industry is CQ room and this is our safety water tank this is safety water pump this is tank and this is demo room this is Arduino Mega this board we used full overall system and this is Arduino Ono we use this board subsystem and this Arduino Ono board connected to this Arduino Mega and this is node MCU we have passed all the data on the web in this module this is industry main gate we tried to put all kinds of security let's see this part at first authorized people will have to do an authorized check throughout the card punch this is authorized card and unauthorized card authorized people will can enter for temperature checking at first we check authorized card this is authorized card at we see the message please scan your temperature temperature is normal and this door automatically open I check this authorized card another authorized card Temperature is too high, that's why this door is not open. This is unauthorized card. I punch this card. Access denied. And this is push button. People can get out of the industry through this push button switch. Press. This is the car parking system in our project. With this system, we can find out how many cars are inside and their space. If there is space in the parking lot, the parking door will open automatically and the door will be closed after the car enters.
if there is no parking space the parking door will not open and the message is not available in space this is our system secure room this room can access through authorized people card parts there are two cards one authorized and other one unauthorized card first we are checking the door open through the authorization card this is unauthorized card if i try to open the gate with this unauthorized card the door will not open this is the product counting machine in our system this machine can count how many products are going in the serial here we used a sensor for counting and display to see the output on the display here we used a gear motor as a demo and used motor driver ic to control the gear motor speed when we turn on the switch our machine will start for counting now we will check the voltage and current faults here we have used voltage sensor for measuring low voltage and current sensor for measuring current overloaded if there is a problem the alarm will sound and send the message with real time location and also call will go away immediately firstly we will check the voltage we can see on the display that the voltage is 217 voltage we have used voltage dimmer regulators to increase or decrease the voltage let's reduce the voltage We can see that the voltage is low and the alarm is ringing and also the main power is off. At the same time messages and call are going on the mobile. Let's check the current overloaded issue. We can see on the display that our current is 0.00, .00 amperes because we have no load firstly turning on a fan to see the load we can see the current of 0.63 amperes now i power two fans together seeing that is 1.4 ampere current consuming it is normal load our main power transformer is 1.4 amperes now I make a short circuit for overloaded. We can see on the display that the current is overloaded and at the same time the alarm is ringing and the main power is off. Also instant calls and SMS have arrived on our mobiles. We can see our real time location. Now we will check the temperature, humidity, gas and fire detection in our monitoring. First we are checking the temperature and humidity. We can see that the temperature and humidity are high. Also instant call and SMS have arrived on our mobiles. Now we will check the gas level. And now we will check the fire detection. Fire detection will turn on the automatic safety pump and SMS will come to our mobile with the real time location.
and this is our IoT part here we are sending all data on the web and controlling some necessary system for there this is our web page we will be able to control two lights two fans main power and main gate also see real time location with temperature humidity gas and fire detector status light one light two fan one fan two and if you turn off the main power here both the fan will be turned off In the same way, we can control the main door. First, we are checking the temperature and humidity status. Then, we are checking gas status. And now, we will check the fire status. That's all our project. Thank you.